Hello, welcome to Guru Focus. This is the eighth episode of Mastering the Guru Focus site, a series designed to help you learn your way around at gurufocus.com. In this episode, Excel and API, we take a look at what an API is and what API features are available on Guru Focus. We will also go over our most popular API, the Excel add-in, which pairs Guru Focus data with Microsoft Excel for fully customizable data downloads and research. So what is an API? For those who don't know, an API, or Application Programming Interface, is basically a messenger that allows multiple types of software to interact with each other using something called queries. You send a query, you get a response. For example, downloading the Guru Focus Excel add-in allows users to use Microsoft Excel to access data from Guru Focus. Users can then arrange the data in a specific way to support their investing research. To download the Excel add-in, simply go to the Screeners tab, go to the Tools category here, and find the Excel add-in. The blue button on the top here is the Excel add-in download for Windows, while the one on the bottom is for Mac. On this page, you can also find Guru Focus's tutorials and reference manuals for using the add-in, including the FAQ section here. Once you download and install the Excel add-in, the next step is to create a new Excel document. Then, go to the new Guru Focus tab all the way on the right here, and log into your account. This is an important step, because um, without logging in, the API won't be able to communicate with the Guru Focus site. For more information on the types of data that you can import with this feature, make sure to check out the Excel add-in page in the link provided below. One good starting point for new users is the Guru F functions reference here. Downloading this will give you access to an Excel document with a bunch of function references. So as you can see here, this is how you would calculate the revenue for Apple, say, or how you would calculate the one-year asset growth rate of a company, that sort of thing. Next. Let's go over the answers to the most frequent questions we get from new users about the Excel add-in. 1. How to insert a basic function, and 2. Issues that could prevent the data from loading. You can insert a function easily by going to the Guru Focus tab and going to Insert Guru F here. The most basic parameters are the ticker and the calculation. So say if I wanted to look for data on Apple, I'd put in Apple's ticker. And then for the calculation, say I wanted to look up the current price of the stock. One last thing I want to highlight is that Guru Focus actually has several other API options besides Excel, which you can find under the Schooners tab and right under the Excel add-in. Please note that unlike our Excel add-in, which is fairly easy for new users to pick up, our other API features, such as Python, Java, Android, iOS, Ruby, um, they require in-depth knowledge of the programming language you want to use as an interface. So we recommend sticking with the Excel add-in for people who are new to API. That's all for this video. In the next episode, show me the data we will be going into detail on where you can find the sources, origins, and definitions for the many data points collected on Guru Focus. Stay tuned! If you want to see more from Guru Focus, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel or find us on social media. Thanks for watching!